is for Avaya Workplace. And in this video, I want to show you how to um, transfer a call and receive a call when it comes through on your workplace. So the first thing I want to do is get the Avaya Workplace up on the screen here. And what I would like to do is show you what happens when you receive a call. So when a call comes in, it will show up the bottom of your screen and you can click on the green handset here or the green handset there. I'm going to click here. I'm going to answer the caller. The caller will show up at the bottom of your screen. At this point, let me go over the icons across the screen at the bottom. You can hang up on the caller by hitting in call. The camera is no longer available. The dial pad, you can click on and use it. You can place the caller on hold. And when you place the caller on hold, there will be a timer to let you know how long they've been on hold. To resume the call, you will click on resume call. While they are on hold, they will have music and will not be able to hear you. More options is here with the three lines and then you can uh, mute the call. You will have the blue circle that shows up around mute the call. Every time that the caller is put on hold, they will have music. At this point, let me show you how to transfer a call to someone in the office that is located in your contacts, meaning that they will be in the list when you do the search. So the first thing I'm going to do is click on the three dots here for more options, and I'm going to go transfer call. Here is where you can search your contact. So if the person is in your contact, you can type their name. Once you find their name, Chad, you can click on the person and then do transfer call. And once you hit transfer call, it's going to transfer the call um, doing a blind transfer, meaning you're not announcing the caller. So once I click call transfer, the call is going to go directly to Chad Hub. And this is how you transfer a call in the Avaya workplace.